where doesn't he fit in? Um, I don't want to reveal too much about Preacher because yeah. he's one of these guys that uh, he comes in sort of late in the story and you don't really know anything about him. And I don't really know anything about him yet. Um, but he he has a lot to do with everything we find out. So, cool. Yeah, he's going to be cool. I, I, I'm going to be very vague about my own character. Yeah, yeah. But I'm going to bring some incredible voice to it and uh, I'm going to make him very... Uh, smart and a menacing i get to play sort of a pseudo bad guy is all i can say which is really fun for me cool. he would really get along with uh wraith enzyme junkie lieutenant ford from stargate atlantis the right. shark-eyed menacing uh jerk that wanted to kill every every wraith on the planet single-handedly i think they would get along swimmingly just wonderful they right would get along. Yeah. yeah he wouldn't get along with original happy uh, bright-eyed bushy-tailed aiden who just wanted to like <laughs> fire guns and blow things up. Right. Yeah. And yeah. It's like, yes sir, yes sir, I'll kill stuff. But second Aiden, yeah, you'd love that. This was uh, a funny thing. I got on my Twitter and um, as soon as I had my, my first meeting with the producers of, of State of Sin and I said, and I said, you know, it looks like there might maybe a chance that we're getting the band back together a little bit. And my Twitter exploded. I, I think I got a thousand retweets on that one thing. It was ridiculous. <laughs> it was like, boom, 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 boom. And everyone was like, you can't do that to us. You can't tease us like that. Because I just hashtagged it, SGA of uh, Stargate Atlantis. Ah. And people were freaking out for that whole day. It was so funny. And I got calls from from Smoke Bomb and Shaftesbury like, you know you can't say anything yet, it's not, it's not. I was like, I was just joking around, don't yeah. worry, I wasn't saying anything. Like, I could tweet that at any time, it was vague enough. Yeah. And finally, when I, uh, when it got unleashed, we've gotten a lot of great feedback on Twitter with this, and that relates to uh, Jewel State and David Hewlett, who, um, Jewel, who I, who I actually didn't work with, right. because we sort of cross paths yeah. as far as me leaving and, and her coming in but I have spent time with her just because we're all sort of friends and she's a foodie and so we had some really great dinners together and um, David Hewlett who played Rodney McKay on Stargate Atlantis and SG-1 uh, who's a dear friend of mine who uh, I'm really excited for his role as well because it looks like we're probably gonna have to butt heads at one point or another. <laughs>